I really don't know how to tune, I'm just kind of making it cool sounding. I'll go to this one. <laughs> Star method. <laughs> Alright, man. You ready? Mm hmm. <laughs> that, was, that was fake. Oh, I'm bored of it. Are you ready? It was fake. No, it wasn't. Don't it was fake. Yourself. Don't kid yourself. I'm not kidding. Alright, here we go. Alright, here we go. <laughs> oh man! No, no, take, take that off. So, so, what was your favorite part about tracking drums? Dude, why don't we just have the it was, it went by really fast actually, surprisingly. I was nervous, still am, about the quality, how it's going to turn out, but you know, we'll see how it goes. This is, is weird. <laughs> How is yeah? How is it working with Zach Warren? It's actually uh, you know easier than I thought it would be. Uh, he actually he's, he gave positive feedback and also it was good to take criticism from him. He helped me out a lot. My, like first time using a click track, I was pretty intimidated. <laughs> through it and we got done in a short amount of time. Right? I'm pretty satisfied. So, so what, pick, what was what was your biggest what was your biggest influence for writing the new stuff? Uh, biggest influence was just you know, sitting in my room and listening to a lot of like music that wasn't metalcore I should say. Learning new grooves just How has, how has it been, what's it been like hanging out in Tremont in Utah? <laughs> Dude, nice. It freaking sucks. It's cold, it's windy, I want to get out of here. But, it's going to be all worth it though. Well, I just finished rebuilding. Um, track three, or is it track three? Um, yeah, anyways, so uh, right now I'm gonna go in and knock out the unbalanced song and take it section by section, and hopefully it goes out pretty well. So, do you. What was it like switching from a big studio to a home size studio? Being in, in a home rather than a big studio? Let's just say that puts that out of the land. It blows it out of the land, since we don't live in water. Dang it! All right. Being honest. Uh, 
Um, this studio is legit, and it's in one little bedroom. It's where it's at. The scratch track there. But yeah, just slow down your snares instead of one, two, three, four, one, okay. two, three. So instead of your snare being on the three, it's going to be on the one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, All right, four. Let's do it. You ready? Mm -hmm. What are, do you have big anticipations for this album? Do you expect it to sound big? <clears throat> of course I do. I'm really confident with how this EP is going to turn out. It's unlike anything we've ever heard before. And even for Zach, too. So um, I'm really confident this is going to like help us a lot. And, yeah, big props for Zach. Tell us about your kit. Well, my kit is a D-drum. Uh, I use three toms. Um, I use a nice Tama steel snare. It's about 13 inches. And I like to um, say I love Zildjian. And... Uh, I use Vic Firth size 3A sticks and DW9000 pedals. Shout out to my buddy Dakota Salmons for uh, helping me out with everything, all the equipment, and helping me get the drums sound up to par. And same for Johnny Faraday. Johnny Faraday, you know, he saved he saved my butt <laughs> for this recording to happen. So props to him as well. What is your favorite part? <clears throat> what is your favorite part about the recording so far? Like, what 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 have you been loving on it? I just love the quality. I love how everything, it's a lot easier to, you know, fix mistakes now with the click track and and then, then again, just hanging out with my bros, just enjoying everybody's company. That's just the main thing for me. Take your shirt off. Take the shirt off. Don't do it. You'll make all of us look bad. Strip. Strip it up. Dude, we're in Tremont. There's no chicks here. Give us something. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Oh, salsa, salsa, salsa. Now, do, jerk. Do a jerk. <laughs> do the grease. Do the grease dance. <laughs> Ow! Any last words to people who are watching this? Get ready for something huge. Wait, I've got one. How is it spooning with Robbie in the bed at the hotel? You know, by the way, spooning with Robbie isn't that bad, people. Mom, especially to you, it's it's really not bad at all. It's quite comfortable. And I don't care what any any of you guys say, I'm going to do it again until we go back home. It, 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 might, it might be you too, Dylan. It might be you, Chris. One of you is going to get it as well. Not just Robbie. I'm happy. Get out of my life. <laughs> <laughs>